Oh, my lungs, my legs, a bit sore. I hoped but that's racing yeah it was a hard day the hardest race I think I've ever done mentally physically I wanted to stop nearly every five kilometers just going through like little I'd have gel and feel okay and then just be completely dead again the next second um, same on the bike it just wasn't quite quite there so yeah really upset but I am proud I finished. I could have pulled out, like I said, at any second. I'm glad I finished, to finish the season. And get my medal and my t-shirt. I don't know, this year has been odd. I think from the pullover from the COVID year and races getting changed and maybe a bit, a bit, a bit sporadic, maybe. We haven't delved into too much of like the numbers and stuff. Lots to take away, like bike fitness, general, like overall, progression through the year to go look back and see what maybe or why it wasn't as good as or I didn't race quite as well as I, I know I can. I swam strong, um, I, like I said before I wanted to go sub or around 50, I went below 50 leading the swim. It was super hard to swim through the pro men and ending up swimming through the age groupers on the back of the 70.3. It's really quite challenging at times just to find your rhythm. And overall it was a really good swim. I like let it out, got a horse record and you can say they even exist these days. So yeah, that, that, I'm really happy with that but then the rest was a bit meh. Uh, all the drinks, all the food. <laughs> Gonna go play golf. Off season, I need it. Right, at the beginning of the year we didn't even expect to be doing a full Ironman and to do a full distance race and to do three we it's probably suppressed expectations. I've raced seven times, I've travelled a lot, it's been a long year and that accompanied with all the other stresses that come along with it, I definitely need some time away from triathlon and to do everything but 
swim, bike, run. I love exercise, as I've said before to Bill. He's like, you know, you're not getting on your bike and you're not going running. So hopefully we'll be doing some like walking and stuff. You can't neglect what you put your body through in those races and it's so much harder than you may give yourself credit like on your heart and your lungs and your whole like respiratory system. So I'm gonna respect that and give it a good a good break. Put on some winter weight, enjoy some more cakes, lots of baking, a few beers, some champagne just because <laughs> What's not to celebrate? <laughs> but celebrate life when you can. Uh, yeah, I think that's about it.